Hi, Pastor. I'm Jonathan. Very pleased to meet you. Thank you very much. Wow. I'm in here. Yeah, that's the same. Yeah, I'm um, Bishop Joseph Kimani. I live in Bahati, Nakuru, North. I came here maybe 20 years ago, around, and I have. I'm a member of the Body of Christ worldwide. But in Kenya, I've registered the Kenya National Virgin Fellowship with a movement of believers. When I came here, there was a lot of problems. I found people from, who are squatters, and they came. They had uh, settled here. That's when I started the, the Nazareth School, because I, I found there's a need to redirect the, the children mm -hmm. to know God, to know how to read and write. Because I saw what is happening with the Islamic fundamentalism. When they pick the, our young children, train them, teach them, and they make them Al Shababs and uh, extremists. Or for destruction. Mm -hmm. So I thought as a Christian I have to volunteer myself to do this as a ministry in service to God. And in this area then there was no water. We were going six to seven kilometers in Bahati mm -hmm. using Dunkirk. Maybe when you stay a bit you may meet with some of them. And then I had this vision of a borehole. I called the, geor the geologists to come and check. But uh, I what, just... What is the depth of this well? It's 150 meters. 150 meters. He came and checked and told me there's water here. And do you know off the top of your head the, the total cost of, of drilling drilling this well? All yeah. what I've done here is... Yes. Well, this one was making only the hole. The hole only. Was one million five hundred. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. One one million five hundred thousand. Mm -hmm. So be it. This water shillings. goes... We'll go to school. Mm -hmm. To help the children now. Mm -hmm. And also be used in the center, in the orphanage. Mm. And is the water sweet? Hmm? Is the Very water good. Good. Very good. Maybe okay. you, you, you'll you test it. I, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'd love, love to. Yeah, you'll test it. It's, God gave us the best well here. Praise God. Without fluoride, free of fluoride. Mm -hmm. yeah. And very healthy. Yeah, but we only grow food there. This is a proud portion. That's in my Go up to that. Oh, I see. I already first one. Yeah. For the community, the community will be getting water from here now, mm -hmm. and this is the borehole. I see. So we are planning that. I've been uh, depending on God, mm -hmm. the gifts they sent, mm -hmm. the believers sent. I make use of them. Yeah. And because of poverty, yeah. these young people and lack of knowledge of and ways of earning money, of course, because they should learn te technical skills yes. for self-employment, and that's what is now right. in, will be here. Now you, now you're running for. Senate, is that right? Yes, the, new, the, new, yeah, the new constitution, uh, yeah, the new Kenyan Yeah, I'm Senate. running for this county Senate. Yeah. And when is the election? Uh, they have not agreed properly. It will oh, be now uh, in December. That's right. That's a, oh that's a loaded my. question. I'm yeah. sorry. We are all confused. Yeah, yeah. But um, I, it has to be approved. I've, I've applied for funding I see. Uh, in, from the Christian yeah. Party uh, in, in, uh, in Europe. So if they are going to give me money, then I'll be all right. What do you, because what do as you a person now, believers want to support me. They do not want a party, right? Because parties have no, become so, the uh, political parties have become so tribal. No, but you're a man. You're a man called to the ministry of yes. government. Yes, and that's that's yeah. my vision. Yeah. And that's what God. I feel God has done it. I have been the member of parliament, mm -hmm. and when, the, when believers met, the Christians, the bishops met, they said, "No, we need to have our own person now." Mm. But they themselves have never mm -hmm. been to politics, mm -hmm. so they came to me. Bishop, we are taking you back to parliament, mm -hmm. not even to parliament, but 
as a senator. As a senator. Yes. So that's what I'm looking for. What, what I've applied for funding mm -hmm. from in Europe, from the Christian Party. They wanted to give me money in the I Christian think. Party. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think they'll do that because they have been so much concerned. Even believers here are so com concerned. You can even maybe ask him. They were bombed two yeah. days ago, isn't it? Yeah. In Mombasa. Yeah. Isn't it? Uh -huh. yeah. When the crusade. Right. So we have no peace. Right. If we just sit down and say well, we wait for Jesus, or we are believers, we are going to heaven. Of course. Then of you, course. You, 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 someone will take and, you and to heaven before you are you, your time. Let me ask you, because that's the answer that we get from Christians so much when we're trying to get them to get involved uh, in the United States. Many evangelical Christians, they say, but in Jesus is coming soon. <laughs> it's all, it all has to get worse. They say it has to get worse. But you don't no, have they that have world to view. Be, they have That's to wrong. But they, if you have, a, a, a better Christian is the person who is combining it. Yeah. You should have a world view. Yeah. You must, you must have the spiritual view and world view. Because we, this is the world I'm living. That's why I have a cow. Right. That's why I'm keeping See, the, the body of Christ needs to be holy. Because it, it, it represents God, God, God himself. We are children of God. So anybody who is a child of God cannot be a gay or lesbian. They will not say people to find uh, to do abortion. No, because that's anything that's against God. Mm -hmm. This person of God must be uh, against that. Must be for God, but not that which is against God. Can can I ask you about the law of God? We we know the dietary requirements like pork, don't eat, don't eat, don't drink these certain things. Those have passed away. But many people say that even the moral requirements of the law of God have passed away. Um, is that the case? No. In fact, it has been enhanced. In fact, at this time of of this gazing, of immorality, it has been enhanced. Those in the body of Christ to enhance moralism. The third firm in Christ, be ready to die for studying holy. We need to be holy because God is holy. We should be holy. And yeah. that's why the body of Christ should stand a holy Organ, the uh, Christians uh, have Christ. changed the message. It is very soft. They don't mind when if you are gay. Mm -hmm. They have uh, uh, attracted immoral immorality, evils in the in, in themselves. Mm -hmm. And this one is making even those who would like to come to Christ, especially the young people, to get astray. Mm -hmm. That's why they are going to Al Shabab, mm -hmm. the Muslim uh, the fundamentalism, being used badly. They are rebellious to the Church of Christ mm -hmm. because they see what the the, the, the so-called Church of Christ of today is doing. They are aborting. They are doing prostitution. They are they, they can even kill mm -hmm. at will. And the especially lesbianism and gayism is totally anti God. This is what they destroyed in Sodom, and that's what what they are doing now. Mm -hmm. So they see there's there's no need to actually they don't see the meaning of a church. The, gener the, the current generation does not see the meaning of a church of today, or the one that so called church of a building, where people always go. Is a church as, as is a church community. a building? Is a church a building? Those people believe church is a building, but the church is not a building. The church, the church is actually we those who believe in the in the body of Christ, those who are holy, those who are for God, who are ready to sacrifice to to die. For the truth, are the church is the organic body of Christ. Amen. It's something uh, the church is alive. Amen. It's a moving body. You are the church. Mm -hmm. We have. I belong maybe. To, I'm the head L or the ear. Living stones. Yeah, the yes. living stones. Yeah, praise yeah. God. But not. This, would you would you say is it fair? I don't mean to interrupt you there. Is it fair to construe the kind of what we spoke about before the the use of the international aid uh, aid money? international aid money as a form of you know to to bribe or to or to cajole the governments to do against the will of the people or the will of the parliament is that a form of colonialism it's actually it's a form of slavery yeah it's a colonialism because they are trying to pressurize poverty use the the poverty in africa to bring immoral things to impose immorality upon citizens of mm. this of mm. this of these countries mm. like gazing Mm -hmm. or, or res lesbianism. Mm -hmm. It's something very foreign. In Africa mm -hmm. we don't have that, such a thing. But now they are going, they are going to influence the youth mm -hmm. for immoral things, getting mm -hmm. them out of the church mm -hmm. because of this money. It's immoral. Even this government should not accept this money. Mm -hmm. And there should be re registration that nobody should do, do that and those who do it 
be prosecuted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they should be in jail. Mm -hmm. Gays. I think if they, don't you think, if they investigated, for instance, this guy who's bringing gay to Africa, that's the name of the tour, gay to Africa, bringing these gays here, don't you think if they investigated them <clears throat> to see what they're doing while they're here, that they're already doing things against the law? Yeah, but sometimes they, they, these people visiting in this continent, yeah. they disguise themselves. Yeah. Maybe they're not coming in the name of gays, they are coming in another name. Oh, yeah. I can I can show you on the internet. They come and the the name of their tour group, yeah. Gay to Africa. That's ridiculous. The government should not allow them. Yeah. They should, they should deny them a visa. Yeah. We do not need them in Africa. Yeah. Yeah. And if I'm a senator, I'm going to bring a register, a, bi a bill to turn this down unless, and I believe it will pass because all people, even those members of parliament, mm. their parents, mm. nobody wants to see his, his son being a gay mm -hmm. or his daughter being a lesbian is, is, is totally wrong of course and um, i should appeal to our government mm -hmm. not to accept this money mm -hmm. let us use our own ways to create wealth mm -hmm. not to depend on, on the west mm -hmm. yeah that's slavery yes yes okay. thank, thank you pastor this is what, the, what we are building here and this office all this glass and the room of the matron this will be the rooms from one to six 7 to 12, dining, and plus the TV room and the kitchen. This will be toilets, gents and ladies. But in this case, we do not want to mix the, the children. Mm -hmm. We shall only have either boys or girls, but mostly boys. We want to deal with the boys. Mm -hmm. Because you know of our boys, the, you have seen the program Patrick is doing now. Mm -hmm. Boys are the ones being destroyed for mm -hmm. drugs or mm -hmm. gay, gays. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we need to bring up in the moral, mm -hmm. yeah, and uh, without any complication. This is the plan. Mm -hmm. yeah. the good there the is thing. a project mm -hmm. we are doing. Uh, yeah. That is www.projectc. Mm -hmm. We are about to register it as an international organization. Mm -hmm. It's just anti-gay and an anti-abortion. A non-government. A non-government organization. Mm -hmm. What we have tried is try to educate young people. No, I know poverty is one key thing, and you know because they are using money. They are trying to induce that uh, evil mind to our mm. young people. Mm. I'm trying it with a uh, uh, waku in Eldoret, mm. but uh, w let me tell you. You know, do you know that I am so special but, that but you also Ken, Ken you Hiba <coughs> called me personally on my cell phone. This is the man we were talking about who leading these mm. homosexual safari, gay safaris. He called me to threaten me personally. Mm -hmm. But I told me, I told him. Yeah, that's what I wanted to tell you. Yeah, with your mere because threat. Because for him now, you, it is very easy for him to, to disappear. Mm -hmm. In Kenya, we talk of disappearance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because when he's, he's anti-gay mm -hmm. and he's fighting the system, then he can disappear. So, he is a very important man, and he should, we should pray for him. That God gives. I want to appeal protection. now to the believers in America, in Britain, all over the world. To send us here booklets or books on the subject of the cell churches because here the body of christ requires to be organized in the cell form we well, are also appealing because here getting a, a computer is not easy not everybody has a computer mm -hmm. for believers who are, have the ability and have been blessed by the lord to send us laptops so that we are able to send to ourselves cell churches, the believers in houses, because we have house churches mm -hmm. in the rural areas where we, ca we can operate them by and install uh, solar panels to run their computers. So I'm appealing to, for books, for materials, study materials on the cell church and on the body of Christ. Because that's, we have realized here in Africa that the churches, the so-called churches, have become the domains of demons. Where gayism is allowed, lesbian is going to be allowed, all evils have been allowed. So we have come out from the so called churches, and then we have started house churches, or grand cell churches over the country in Kenya and in Africa. Mm -hmm. And so I'm praying to them because here, a computer, almost 70% or 90% mm -hmm. of the rural community, a computer is a foreign thing to them. But you need to educate them, bring up, mm -hmm. bring the, them up. Mm -hmm. You see, you who have the computer there, mm -hmm. give us. We need materials to teach others. To, we want to, to have a strong outreach. 